morning gorgeous angels and welcome back to another video this video is one that has been so highly requested for such a long time and i'm so excited to finally be doing it today we're gonna do my tanning routine yeah 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 we all know i'm the fake tan queen honey i literally get asked by you guys so much what my favorite fake tans are how i apply them my top tips and everything like that so i'm really really excited to be bringing you guys this video if you're excited please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and of course if you're new here angel hello welcome my name is ellie we upload videos every tuesday thursday and sunday on this channel babes so i would love for you to join the fam so in today's video i'm actually trying out a brand new tan um as you can see it has worked absolutely wonderfully i feel like a bronze goddess right now so i actually tried out the brand new bondi sans tan which is the aero i have literally been so excited about this tan ever since i saw the first like hint it was coming i have loved bondi sans since i was like 14 years old and um yeah i'm just really really proud to be working with them on today's video literally like at the release of their aero tan at coachella i was like watching every single vlog that featured it and i just couldn't wait to try it out myself so i'm really really excited to see what you guys think before we get started i just wanted to quickly let you guys know about a few things that you guys might not know about the new aero tan so this is available at boots and this is literally supposed to be like the dream fake tan so this is a really light aerosol formula tan whilst it also being really light it gives you a really gorgeous deep bronze color i really don't feel orange at all actually wearing this i've just realized actually how like deeply bronze this actually makes you also it's supposed to be the longest lasting tan yet from bondi sands obviously i cannot vouch for that because i only applied this last night but i have every single faith just as every other bondi sands product that this is going to live up to the hype so without further ado sit back relax grab a cup of tea and enjoy the video angels can't wait till we bronze goddesses with you Baby. When you okay angels so first of all you're gonna need to set yourself up an evening scrubbing station as i like to call it this needs to be your little sanctuary for the evening or for the you know 15 minutes of the evening and you need to get yourself nice and ready and exfoliated for this fresh tan so first of all you're gonna need an exfoliating mitt i'm using the bondi sans one you will also need a good razor one that is nice and soft don't use anything that is gonna like cut you up you know and then of course you're going to want an exfoliating scrub then just just literally scrub top to bottom here you can see my lovely toes making an appearance but yeah you just literally want to get like all of the old tan all of the dead skin cells off of your body ready for a nice fresh layer of some bondi sans aero tan am i right ladies the reason I like to do this in the evening is just because that gives me more hours for my tan to develop because I'll sleep with it on. You guys will see later that the tan is actually really, really lightweight and um, it dries really quickly so it won't be staining your bed sheets, which is a godsend. After you're all exfoliated, I like to use some moisturiser. Actually, rather than shaving cream, I just find that it makes my skin feel way softer. So I'll just take any moisturiser Put it on my leg where I am about to shave and then I will just use my razor and literally get rid of all those pesky little hairs. Um, because unlike many gorgeous girls, I am not hairless. I wish I was, but you know, this razor comes in handy. Okay, and as we can see here, my gorgeous starting point, nice and pale and a little bit red actually. I've been rubbed raw with that exfoliating mitt, but we are ready to go with a new fresh tan and I'm so excited as you can probably tell. So just to apply the tan, I'm going to use a Bondi Sands tanning mitt and then obviously the Aero tan, which comes out in a magical way you guys just watch yeah i know pretty crazy right okay so as you guys will see in a sec i'm actually going to do two layers of this tan um the tan bottle recommends to do one layer and then half an hour after that initial application you do a second layer in order to get like the deepest tan that you can possibly get from that first evening of tanning i was really impressed actually just with the first layer i considered not doing a second layer but then i thought no boo come on i'm the tanning queen it was actually even really easy for my back tanning partner to um assist me in this tan he was also thoroughly impressed 
In all seriousness though, um, Connor did actually really like the tan because his big thing when he applies tan on me is that like it doesn't blend in very well. Um, but he really, really liked this one and I really liked it as well. I just thought it went on so seamlessly, so effortlessly and I really, really liked the way that it dried so quickly. I could literally get dressed straight away. It wasn't sticky whatsoever. I could actually hardly smell at all. Like it didn't smell like fake tan. It just smelled like a really nice sort of coconut moisturizer scent. And yeah, the actual application um, part of the procedure actually went really, really smoothly and I am a big, big fan of the way this tan went on. As long as I got you Okay, and then when the second layer of tan is all on and dry, which literally takes about three seconds for that to happen, um, I just personally like to go over any areas that the tan might have got that I didn't want it to, such as the palms of my hands. So I'll literally just take a makeup wipe or a cotton pad and some um, cleansing water, and I will just literally brush the pad over my hand, over the palm of my hand, and um, it will just get rid of any tan that wasn't needed. And then here's me feeling as fresh as a daisy coming out of the shower the next morning, the morning after I applied it. As you can tell, I definitely look way darker. I feel much more bronzed, but I really, really love the tone of the tan. It definitely gives you like really seamless, gorgeous bronzed results. It's definitely one of my new faves and I would highly recommend it to all of my tanny angels. Okay, Angel, so there we have it. There is my fake tan routine with the new Bondi Sands Aero Tan. I am literally such a big fan of this tan and i'm also a poet and i didn't know it seriously i really cannot tell you guys how amazing this product is this is going to be my absolute go-to like from now on i know you're not really supposed to do this but i was so impressed with the original application before i even washed it off like literally five minutes after i applied it i was like wow and i would actually wear it out as an instant tan like i said i know you're not supposed to do that and i don't recommend it but just being completely honest with you guys it dries that quickly that like i literally got dressed straight away including like a bra which would usually like leave marks but yeah because it dries so quickly i really just think it's such an amazing really easy tan to apply it also smells really nice so that's another reason why i like wouldn't really worry about having to wait until i need to wash it off it literally smells like a coconut it's so nice i'm just saying boo if i was running low on a night out and i was like oh my goodness my legs need another layer i would not be scared to quickly put on this tan Aero tan, I'm a big fan. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, Angels, and I really hope that it helped some of your questions. I know I get a lot of questions in regards to tying and everything, quite a lot. So, yeah, hopefully you really enjoyed it. If you do have any more questions, then please just leave a comment below. I'll be getting back to everybody. And, um, yeah, love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!